This video covers Multi-V systems in LATS HVAC. To begin creating the Multi-V system, select New and adjust the conditions and information of the system as necessary. Choose between Heat Recovery and Heat Pump under ODU Types. Under Simulation Mode, choose between the Cooling or Heating Mode, or both, depending on which capacity values you want in the report view. You may change the indoor cooling and heating temperatures, but the RH percentages must be set to 50. In the selected heat recovery system, you can choose from Y branches and or HR boxes. Double click on the HR box to set a unique ID for your HR box or to set the elevation of your HR unit. You can check all to set the elevation for all the HR boxes in the system. Double-click the system title to edit settings. You can switch from heat recovery to heat pump. You can also adjust pipe length. In the selected heat pump system, you can place Y branches but not HR boxes. Just like heat recovery system, you can set a unique ID for your Y branch. In the heat pump system, there is no option to set the elevation height. There are a couple of ways to insert an indoor unit into the system. You can click and drag it into the system and edit the properties as necessary. Or you can double click on the standby box and select indoor units or any of the other pipe accessories. You can only modify room temperature if diversity is set as on in Properties, and you can add accessories. You can apply the accessory to all models in the system or just for the selected model. Double click on the Room icon or click Load Summary to add room information. You can double click on the Outdoor Unit icon to select a different unit model. You can either manually select from the list of models, or you can check Auto Select, and the program will automatically select a model based on the combination ratio. You may also add accessories to the ODU. You can always view the combination ratio. It is the ratio of total IDU capacity to ODU capacity. The recommended ratio range is between 50 and 130%. After you have configured your Multi-V system, check the system to verify that it is set up correctly. Click on Auto Piping to automatically correct the pipe diameter and Y branch size as necessary. After Auto Piping is completed, click System Check. After running the System Check, click Validation Property. These system checks must be repeated after any changes are made to the system. This concludes the LATS HVAC Multi-V Systems video.